The following content is provided under a Creative Commons license. Your support will help MIT OpenCourseWare continue to offer high-quality educational resources for free. To make a donation or view additional materials from hundreds of MIT courses, visit MIT OpenCourseWare at ocw.mit.edu. When you have a group of two or three, come grab a soldering iron and your solar cells from me and choose like somewhere in this room to work. We're just, we're staying in here for this. Do you want us to overlay it? Yeah. Oh, you don't, you're not actually soldering directly. Yeah, you don't want to overlay it. So these three contacts will be parallel and these will be serious. Yeah, so you generally want to go yeah. like, you, the way you would generally do it is you would, so I think it's less critical that you cover this entire set, um, so if you cover a little bit of it and solder to that, and the back is also like all of this is conductive. Uh, the only reason the tabs are there are because the tabs are easier to solder to, and so it's just can, more convenient. Um, and you don't really need to solder to all of them individually, you can only solder, like, at minimal, if you wanted to solder, like do it really minimally, you could just do like a solder from or a wire from there to there, and that would work. Like that would be fine. But the reason that they have a, a lot of them is because if something cracks or something like that, and you can't tell if you have a wire running across, your wire's not going to crack because these are fragile. Uh, and so you have more. Uh, you also have more contacts. So. So you're, you're, you can, you should feel free to wire it however you want, and then we're gonna test them later too. Yeah, we dialed it. Across these two, right? Or do you want us to cut it off in small strips? I'm trying. I'm trying to think if that would work. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know. Like, I don't know if that would work. It'd be a full circuit. Okay. Yeah, but I don't know if you can do that across a specific cell. Like, I feel like that wouldn't work. Because, I mean, it would, it would definitely make sense if you took two of them and you did one one way and you did the other was that you had them going in two different patterns on one side. So you were connecting positive to negative to positive to negative. And then on the other one, you were connecting negative to positive to negative to positive. Uh -huh. Lattice on top. Yeah. Lattice on top. Lattice on top. That's great. Lattice on top. Like that. Right? Yeah. Yeah, do we? That's how you would traditionally do it. Titanium. Oh, no, it was Gwen. It was Gwen that told us. It was Gwen that told us about it. Damn it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, I hate that. And then it starts to burn the butter. Yeah. yeah. So you should also probably cut this shorter because this is electric conductive, even though like even though it's not tabbed, it, like the entire surface is electrically conductive. So if it's touching, it's gonna kind of short. So like this part. Like, you only need this one to touch, is that what you're saying? No, uh, well, that is true. So the thing is that um, all of these are, like, this is all one surface that's electrically conductive. The tabs are just there to make it easier to solder onto, or supposedly make it easier to solder onto. Uh, but the thing is that if you have two of these, like, right next to each other, and uh, they're, like, the backs, like, there's a wire touching, like, this wire is touching this, then you're going to short your... Okay. So you need to do this from here, like, this much length. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
program or if I honestly don't even have time to do that application. <laughs> These are really pretty in the sun. So yeah, so when you're checking voltage, you need to like sort of do it in parallel. Like check it across an element to see how much voltage is being dropped. So in this circuit, the only, so you have this like battery, this is the source, and then the only load is the same. And so this is going to be dropping all of the voltage that is being collected by this, by the solar panel. Again, I think. Is getting any current? You don't have any current this one. Uh, I mean the. Yeah. You're right. Sorry. Two point three six. That's milliamps. Volts. Oh, volts. Yeah, we're checking volts. Nice. Then you don't need the volts. Then you don't need it. Yeah, because this becomes this becomes like the finishing. Oh, so in that case, we're, are we? Oh no, we're gonna still. Yeah, check we'll check the voltage more. across this one. Yeah. That one point two, two point four for the whole thing. Right? Mm -hmm. Excellent. Nice, nice work. Point five eight across the whole cell. Um, what was the resistance? Hundred ohms. It should change it. Yeah. yeah. No, it was still wired. Can we just, yeah, can we just go inside and yeah. do a data switch? All those three numbers. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. I guess there's I don't think we, oh, the first we panel we do, didn't cover a quarter. Of are we going to do a cover on one of these? Yeah, like the same thing. Do you want to just cover the quarter panel for the first one? We didn't actually do that. Sure, let's do that. We just covered one entire cell.